Hello YouTubers, and welcome to Car Guy Corner. Today, we're going to work on my cousin's car and put in a wheel bearing for a 2012 Honda Civic. Well, now to get started, jack up the car. Put a jack stand under it, safety. You're gonna need a breaker bar and a three quarter inch socket. Then do the five uh, lug nuts. You got the tire off. So now we're gonna take the bolts off to get the caliper off. Take the caliper bracket off. We're gonna take off the two bolts for the strut. Take off the tie rod end. Undo the nut for the CV shaft. And we could pull the uh, pull it out and get the bearing changed. So I'll take all that apart, and then we'll come back. Now I got the caliper and the bracket off now. To get the caliper off, you need a 14 mil wrench or socket and ratchet. And then to get the bracket off, you need a 17 mil wrench or socket and ratchet. Then you can get that off. And you might have to beat on this a little bit. Should be some screws in here, but obviously whoever did the brakes last on this never put them back in, so you don't got to worry about it. Tap on it lightly here, and it should break loose. If not, there's two threaded holes you can put some bolts in, and that should push the uh, rotor off of uh, the hub. So I'm going to take that off next. I checked and I found a bolt that... Uh, I have that fits in there. So all you do is thread the bolt in and pushes off the rotor, as you can see. Way easier than beating on it and sometimes beating on it will warp it. So it'd be nice if all vehicles were like this, but not all of them are. Now that the tie rod's off, I'm going to undo these two upper bolt, or two bolts to hold the uh, spindle to the strut. And then all we got left is the wire for the ABS and the lower ball joint. And then push up the CV shaft and we can pull this off to get to the bearing. Now to get these bolts out, you'll need a 17 mil on the bolt side. And you need a 19 mil on the nut side to get it apart. Now you're going to want to disconnect the ABS wire. The plug is underneath this panel. And then unroute the wire. So when you pull this off, you don't know, pull on that ABS wire and then cause more problems. And now that we got the CV shaft pulled out, the bolt for the ball joint, 17 mil. Then we can take this off and work on it on the bench.
see, pretty much back together. Do the same process, taking it apart, just in reverse. You torque the axle nut to 134 foot-pounds, and the lug nuts get torqued to 100 foot-pounds, and then recheck your uh, torque, you know, a few 50 to 100 kilometers, or depending how much you drive. And probably wouldn't hurt to double check this too, because that keeps pressure on your wheel bearing. So double check that again for 134 foot-pounds, and then yeah, wheel bearing changed on a Honda Civic.